I know I vlogged very minimally today. I apologize. Um, my second class finished early. I'm about to get ready to go to the SkyTrain station to meet Victoria and give her her, give her her things. Um, we're getting a little concerned because it shows it's supposed to rain on Friday, which is when our grad party is supposed to be. So, yeah. I just finished dropping off Victoria's yearbook and stuff, and I checked my mailbox and I have a card from my grandparents. So, yay, I'm gonna save it for my graduation day though. So, it's 5.44. I have a few things that I need to do before I leave for Natasha's at about like 6.15 because I'm meeting her at 6.30 in her apartment complex to give her her stuff. Um, so Riley found this thing the other day. So I just created a group chat with all of us that are staying here in Vancouver because if we want to do stuff together, I don't want to send it in the main chat and annoy everyone who's not here. Um, <laughs> so I created, I called it Vancouver Live-In. So I created the Vancouver Live-In chat. And Riley found this thing, I think I mentioned this the other day, she found this thing the other day that's happening on September 5th, and it's like a wizards and witches scavenger hunt type of thing in Vancouver. So like everyone kind of does it individually. You have a team from like two to six people. It's one entry price for one team. It's like $49 right now. And as I said, you can have two to six people on your team. Apparently you can start anywhere between like 9 a.m. and 2 p.m. And it's just like a wizard themed scavenger hunt around the city. Um, so it's, I'm, I'm assuming it's mostly outside. Um, so yeah, Riley and I, Riley and I are totally in. So we at least, we have the two people needed. And now we're messaging, Riley just messaged in the chat um, to say, hey, does anyone else want to join us? Um, so I'm going to buy our ticket because it's 20% off today. So I need to transfer money from a bank account. I just found online a red velvet uh, cupcake recipe with cream cheese frosting, hallelujah, that um, has a whole bunch of really great reviews. It averages like four and a half stars from like a thousand people who've reviewed it, which is great. Um, really happy about that. So I'm going to write down what ingredients I need because tomorrow is when I'm going to North Vancouver to drop off Mackenzie's yearbook and stuff. And to do that as well, um, I'm gonna stop by a place that's called Bulk Barn. It's kind of a, it's a baking place. Uh, Riley and Lisa recommended it to me. Um, and it's like, it has more baking stuff than like just the normal like IGA would have, which is perfect. Cause there's a few things that I need for the idea of cupcakes in my head that IGA doesn't have. So I'm going there. So I need to make sure that like, I'm also gonna do the mild like grocery shopping that I need, even if, a lot of the grocery shopping for like, let's say the milk and the eggs, I do at 7-Eleven right here because they have those things. Um, but like to make sure, is my flour still good? Is my sugar still good? Do I need to get more of that? Do I have enough of it? And all that. So I need to do that before 6.15. Now I am at Natasha's place, dropping off her stuff. Turns out she's only a seven minute walk away from me. I had no idea. So it's 9.43. I uh, was able to read a few more chapters today of my book, yay. I'm kind of almost halfway through it, in a way. Hang on. Yeah, okay, not yet, but like kind of getting there. Um, anyway, as I was sitting here reading and going, wow, it's so nice to have this time to read, um, I then realized that the reason why I had time to read was because I had forgotten that for my episode two class tomorrow, I need to read my classmates, um, basically their pages that they've uploaded, which I meant to do tonight. And then I, when I was walking home from um, giving Natasha and Sumit their yearbooks, I was like, okay, and I need to go home and I'm gonna do this, this, and this, and this, this, and this. Completely forgot about the episode two stuff. So needless to say, I'm going to bed. I'm getting ready for bed now so I can wake up hopefully a little bit earlier. And by earlier, I mean like closer to seven rather than 7.30 um, and, re and have plenty of time to read them in the morning. But needless to say, I'm kind of mad at myself, but it's my it's my last episode two class, so this will be the last time that I forget about it, so yeah. So, with that being said, I'm going to head to bed and uh, sign off or end this for tonight. So thank you so much for watching, hope you enjoyed, all my social media is in the description, love you all.